Welcome one and all, I'm Decoy, back with another crazy camp. And today, we're checking out Will's camp. Now, this is a pretty neat idea, because he built a boombox. And that is just... Yeah, I don't think I've ever seen another boombox out in the wasteland. So, uh, bonus points on uniqueness. Also, hanging out at a cool and unique camp location. So you're going to get some bonus points there as well. Now, I do enjoy the little details on the boombox. Of course, you got a little antenna up top. You got the handle. But you've also got your little AM, FM dial up there. Let me hop up here, get a little closer. But yeah, you got all the different... I mean, I don't know. It's just all these little things that help sell the whole boombox idea. Let's head on inside. So, first thing you get in here, you got a bar area. Overall, the bar looks pretty darn snazzy. Kind of a little bit high class. And, you know, a vending machine's not hooked up, which kind of a good thing, because... I don't know. Some of the vending machines can get pretty darn annoying. That one is pretty darn cool, though. Of course, got a couple displays back here with different liquor on them. Some drinking glasses, as it should be. I, I really do like the bar area. It looks pretty darn nice. And yeah, the different types of liquor on display is a nice touch. Now, opposite the bar area, there's like a little dance floor type spot. And while it's not overly decorated, I really think that the walls and floors that came off the scoreboard are a really nice touch. Let's head up top. Now up here, we move into more uh, a personal space kind of area. Got all the workbenches up here. And overall, the whole little workshop type area looks... It looks pretty darn good. You know, just, just fitting in all these different things around the outside edge up here. And it actually looks halfway decent. I mean, normally you see people trying to cram in all their workbenches and it doesn't really look like it it works but here it just works gosh that was a long way to get to it just works but hey i had to make it happen now over here you got the little bedroom area and of course you've heard the ally talking on and off in the background keep that head up you never know what you might miss otherwise this area pretty darn nice also, kind of cool to see some of the ghillie armor on display. Now, I think it's time we work our way to the very top. And while there's not a whole lot to see up here, this is just where some wiring's going. But also, where that handle is for the boombox. And while it's not lined up exactly perfect, it does the job. And of course power connector being used as an antenna is a pretty neat idea. But now let's work our way out the side exit. See what's going on. Kind of like an emergency exit kind of spot, but I, I do like the, the area under the stairs. Even though it's pretty simplistic, you got like a little smoke break type area over here. Then it, it looks like it belongs here. So overall, pretty darn freaking cool. And then thanks to the location he picked, you, you got like a little parking lot looking thing out here with multiple cars. So it, it really helps to sell this whole little boombox nightclub. Or, I, I don't know, it just, it, it's pretty darn cool. Now, there's nothing really going on on the back side. So, but, I, I don't know. It doesn't really matter. 
I think there was enough going on elsewhere that it was just a really cool camp to get a check out. But that's going to wrap this one up. Huge thank you to Will for letting me share this with all of you. Now, if you've got a crazy camp that you want to share, hop down in the comments, let me know. Please remember to like, sub, and share. Later.